Welcome to Daily Scripture Reading. I do not own the rights to this music. Thank God for unity. The definition of unity, the state of being united or joined as a whole, union, unification, coalition, oneness, agreement. I will read the King James Version of 1 Peter chapter 3, verses 13 through 22. And who is he that will harm you if ye be followers of that which is good? But and if ye suffer for righteousness sake, happy are ye, and be not afraid of their terror, neither be troubled. But sanctify the Lord God in your hearts, and be ready always to give an answer to every man that asketh you a reason of the hope that is in you, with meekness and fear, having a good conscience that, whereas they speak evil of you as of evildoers, they may be ashamed that falsely accuse your good conversation in Christ. For it is better, if the will of God be so, that ye suffer for well-doing than for evil-doing. For Christ also hath once suffered for sins, the the just for the unjust, that he might bring us to God, being put to death in the flesh, but quickened by the Spirit, by which also he went and preached unto the spirits in prison, which sometime were disobedient, when once the long suffering of God waited in the days of Noah, while the ark was a preparing. Wherein few, that is, eight souls, were saved by water, the like figure whereunto even baptism doth also now save us, not the putting away of the filth of the flesh, but the answer of a good conscience toward God, by the resurrection of Jesus Christ, who was gone into heaven and is on the right hand of God, angels and authorities and powers being made subject unto him. The end. God bless you and thank you for joining me today.